The same problem has to be solved. And no matter what natural selection is doing in helping to preserve the information as it comes in, random mutation still has to supply all of the information, and there's no precedent uh, for that uh, being done. Now, I believe that uh, uh, Dawkins uh, uh, understands this problem to, uh, to some degree, um, and uh, he attempts to solve it uh, in various ways, and, and uh, 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 all of the ways operate by smuggling the intelligent designer into the solution. You see, we know you can write an encyclopedia if you've got an intelligent person writing the articles. Uh, so the question is how you do it without intelligence. Well, here, for example, is how uh, early on in The Blind Watchmaker, Dawkins offers to solve the problem. Uh, he, he imagines um, uh, the, the play Hamlet. Uh, and in uh, Hamlet, you may recall, you have Hamlet and Polonius are, are looking at the sky and they see clouds. And Hamlet is sort of making fun of Polonius. And, um, he, you know, the, the clouds often seem to be designed, you know. Doesn't that cloud look like a whale? Ah, yes, it's like a whale, Hamlet, you know, very like it. And Hamlet just toys with him. He says, methinks it is like a weasel. Now, see, in, in part, this is being used to illustrate how something that appears to be designed may, in fact, be the result of purely random air movements. And, and uh, that is indeed the case with, with clouds and, you know, certain kinds of rock formations that might have some vague appearance of design. But then Dawkins takes that and he says, let us take this sentence, methinks it is like a weasel, and show you how we can get it by chance and selection. Now imagine that we have a, some type of computer which is generating random letters. You see, it just generates a random flow of letters, so that eventually every letter comes up. And uh, um, we now have a, um, uh, a, uh, uh, a series of 20-some spaces, however many it is, for this target sentence, methinks it is like a weasel. And now Dawkins says, suppose that we have the random selection of letters is going by in each one, you know, just like in the slot machine, you, you know, new one's coming up all the time. And when you get the right letter in the right spot, the computer saves it. You know, when an M appears in the first spot and an E in the second, we've got me, we're partway towards methinks. You see, and on the other end, an L in the last spot and an E before it, and going backwards, we're partly towards weasel. And in a, in a pretty uh, short amount of time, we get the whole phrase, uh, sentence me thinks it is like a weasel, because we have done it by random mutation, random variation, that is, uh, combined with a selection process. Well, do you see what's wrong? Do you see the fallacy already? Um, it's, um, um, uh, you certainly can get that phrase rapidly. In fact, if you have a rapid enough letter generator and you have a properly programmed computer, you can get the complete works of Shakespeare plus the Cardiff telephone directory as a bonus probably in a matter of hours. And the reason is, of course, because you've